San Diego State shifting gears, hoping to go full-time online learning by next week. But now students are also faced with having to decide where they're going to complete the rest of the school year. ABC 10 News reporter Marie Cornell spoke to one about the changes and how they're affecting him. San Diego State University wants all of their classes to be held virtually by November 25th. Though they haven't seen an increase in COVID-19 cases on campus, they are concerned about the surge of cases in the county and in the state. This is how empty and quiet the campus of SDSU looks like after the university announced plans to go back to online learning, shutting down majority of their in-person classes. Student T. U. says this now puts him in a bind as he needs lab experience. My research depends on real in-person research. I need to operate the machine, which is on campus. I also need like object, which is real man or person. SDSU is halting in-person research for freshmen, sophomores and volunteers. But those who have timely graduation requirements may continue with in-person work on approved critical research projects. I may switch to like a comprehensive class, it means I just take lecture, I don't take any research, which is affecting my graduation because I'm a graduate student, I need some research background, and if I don't have any research background, it's hard for me, for me to find a job or got my PhD like an offer. SDSU is also asking students that will be returning to campus after Thanksgiving break to get a COVID-19 test weekly. That's different from the previous requirement of every two weeks. Reporting from home, Marie Cornell, ABC 10 News.